conversations with the killer. The Ted Bundy Tapes is available to stream and download on Netflix now. The four-part series includes audio tapes of Bundy speaking to journalists Stephen Mike Cord and Hugh Answorth in the early 1980s while on death row. Bundy spoke to them about his crimes and motivations for doing so. Read on to find out more about Mike Cord and Answorth and the tapes. Who are journalists Stephen Mike Cord and Hugh Answorth? Hugh Answorth and Stephen Mike Cord are the two journalists who recorded the tapes with Ted Bundy at Flordius State Prison in January 1980. There are 75 to 90 tapes in total, with over 100 hours worth of audio recording. On the tapes, Bundy speaks mostly in the third person as explains why a person of his nature may murder up to 30 women and potentially more. He also speaks of how he may have aid his innocent victims before going on to protest his innocence. Speaking exclusively to Express.co.uk, Mike Ord explained the audio recordings occurred after he and Answorth were appointed his biographers by Bundy's former wife Carol Coon when they met in Seattle. What are the Ted Bundy tapes? They went on to publish two books about their meetings with Bundy. The first, a biography published in 1983, was called The Only Living Witness which included their reporting and death row interviews with Bundy. The second book, Conversations with a Killer on which the Netflix documentary series is based, was published shortly after his execution, which took place on January 24, 1989. My cord revealed that Bundy agreed to cooperate on the condition that Answorth, an investigative journalist, would look into his case. He said, Bundy agreed to cooperate on the condition that Hugh reinvestigates his cases in search of the exculpating evidence Bundy said he knew for a fact existed, although that proved not to be true. Mike Ord and Answorth feature throughout the Netflix documentary, Conversations with the Killer, the Ted Bundy tapes. They also serve as co-executive producers and consulted with director Joe Bolina throughout the making of the documentary. Stephen Mike Ord Mike Ord is a journalist and author and was 31 years old when he entered Florida State Prison to interview Bundy. In 1978, he had the choice to make between moving to Japan to take over Business Week's Tokyo Bureau or interviewing Bundy. He told Express.co.uk, One day I received a call from my literary agent, Kathy Robbins, inquiring whether I'd be interested in doing a book about Ted Bundy with his cooperation. At the time, I didn't know who Bundy was. So it was Tokyo vs Ted. I called Hugh Answorth, an associate from my earlier days at Newsweek magazine, and an excellent investigative reporter. I asked Hugh if he cared to do the book with me, sure, he replied. My cord and Answorth then flew to Seattle to meet Carol Boone, Ted's wife at the time. He added, Ted, by the time we met face to face at Florida State Prison in January of 1980 was a celebrity, maybe the best known criminal in the world. My main issue wasn't his fame or infamy, but trying to sort out his psychopathy. I knew next to nothing about people who feel no guilt or regret for what they do, no matter how heinous it is. Nor had I ever intimately encountered someone so deeply narcissistic and paranoid. He was, on the other hand, great company at times, and a stracconteur. He described Bundy as handsome, genial, usually, clearly quite bright and articulate. My cord revealed, other times his eyes, normally blue, would turn black as we discussed the more violent episodes in his life. The interviews were exhausting. The reporter was the one who finally got Bundy to talk about his crimes, by getting him to refer to himself in the third person. He explained, only in 1989, when Ted started confessing in the first person, was the awful truth finally on display. 
The what of what he did finally was known, at least in part, by coaxing Ted into talking about himself in the third person, we filled in a lot of the why. When asked what moment still stood out to him to this day from his interviews with Ted. My cord revealed, one day as I was pressing Ted for more details of a murder, he stopped and grinned and said, you know, my cord, I think you'd make a good serial uh, too. I really think you have it in you. Hugh Answorth Hugh Answorth was an associate of Mike Cord at Newsweek magazine and a well-respected investigative reporter. Answorth is considered an expert on the assassination of President John F. Kennedy. He is well known for covering the assassination and for his role in investigating the supposed links between Lee Harvey Oswald and the FBI. He also reported on the trial of Jack Ruby, the man who shot Lee Harvey Oswald. Speaking at the end of the documentary, Answorth recounted, Last time I saw Ted Bundy or talked with him I was so damn sick of his life and his denials of what he told us. Sometimes we'd come out the prison and we'd be actually sick. I just was tired of Ted Bundy and what he'd taken of my life. Really? Conversations with the Killer, the Ted Bundy Tapes is streaming on Netflix now.